Hey art friends, we're so glad you're with us because today is the first art lesson of 2018. Yes, 2018. And we had a lot of fun being on vacation and spending time together, but we miss these guys, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, we miss you guys a lot. So we hope you're excited to draw. And what are we drawing today? A harp seal. Yeah, we're gonna draw a harp seal, but what kind of version? A pup. Yeah, a pup, which means it's a baby. Yeah, a baby, a really cute, fuzzy, white, fluffy baby. Hairball. Hairball. <laughs> Yeah. We hope you're gonna follow along with us. You got a marker and some paper. You well before we start, we should talk about something different in the studio. The background. Yeah, we got a cool new background. We got our awesome logo back with there. Blue lights. Yeah, with blue awesome lights. Looks like a spaceship. Too. Yeah, over there. Looks awesome, huh? Yep. <laughs> Art Studio 2.0. <laughs> let us know in the comments what you think about our cool new background. All right, dude, you ready to start? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Okay, first we're gonna draw our seal's eyes and we're gonna draw them really big. We're gonna draw them over here on the right side so we have room for his body. Now we're using a marker and we have two sheets of paper so that our marker doesn't go through the one sheet and get onto the table. So you don't have to use a marker if you don't want to. You can use a pencil, but we're gonna start by drawing these two big eyes. We're gonna draw two big circles. We're gonna draw them like this. Here's one. And then we're gonna leave a little space. We can come over here and draw another circle the same size right next to it. Yeah. Good job. Okay, now in the top left, we're gonna draw a smaller circle. This is for the light reflecting in our seal's eyes. It's gonna make them look even cuter. And then we're gonna color in the big circle, but leave this little one white. Okay, now on each eye, we're gonna draw a little bump that comes out. So we're gonna draw a little U, comes out like that, back in. Yeah, you drew it on the other side. Oh. That's fine. And then back in, like that. I'll draw it on both sides too. And then, oh, oh, that's all right. <laughs> you drew it on the outside and also the inside. <laughs> that we, you already know what we're gonna draw, so that's okay. We're gonna do the same thing on the outside. And then we're gonna color these in. Okay, now we're gonna draw his nose. We're gonna draw the letter U in between his two eyes, but below, we're gonna draw a little U that comes down, back up. Looks like Good a job. smiley face. Yeah, it kind of does. Now, on each side, we can draw a little, on each side of the U, we're gonna draw his nostrils coming down. So we thicken up the line on each side. And then we're also gonna draw a line that curves in between. And this is for his nose, and then we're gonna color that in too. All right, cool, now we can draw his mouth and we're gonna draw a big J and we're gonna have it come down and then back up and we wanna come up pretty far so he looks like he's smiling. They always look like they're smiling. Okay, and then we're gonna draw the backwards one on the other side. That looks like a puppy face, huh? Yeah, it looks like a puppy. <laughs> now we're gonna draw a U right here for his mouth that's open. Then we can color that in also. Okay, now on each of his cheeks, we're gonna draw three little whiskers, one, Two, three, and then on the other side also. One, two, Now it looks three. like a cat mixed with a dog. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna draw our pup's head. We're gonna start right here next to his left eye, and we're gonna draw a big upside down U or a rainbow line that comes over, down, and then we're gonna keep coming around like this, and we're gonna end just underneath his right eye. And we want it to look like a circle <laughs> that doesn't complete. <laughs> Good job, it's all right. Looks like you. Oh, thank you. He's nice and bald. <laughs> That's funny. I don't have whiskers. That, well, sometimes I do, I guess. <laughs> okay, now we're going to draw the ground, and we're going to draw him laying down on it. So we're going to draw a line that starts right here, and it's going to connect to his head, and then kind of keep curving off to the side. Yeah, good job. Now, right here, we can connect if it didn't quite. If there's a little gap, we can, yeah, connect his head to the ground. All right, now let's draw his first flipper. We're gonna draw over here on the left side. We're gonna draw a curve that comes down and then back up. Kind of looks like a sideways J. Good job, and then we're gonna come back up and end. We don't wanna connect them. I wanna leave a little space. Good, now let's draw the one on the right side. We're gonna draw a line that comes down and then connects into the ground. I'm gonna draw the ground out a little further. Okay, now we're gonna draw three little curves for the toes on his flipper. And we can draw those three little curves over here on this side also. Okay, now we're gonna continue the ground. So right here, we're gonna imagine this line going through his, behind his flipper, 
coming out the back and then curving down. Okay, now let's draw his body. We're gonna start over here on his head and we're gonna draw a curve that comes out, down, and then curves down to the ground. Okay, now right back here, we're gonna draw his little flipper, his tail sticking out the back, his back flippers. So we're just gonna draw another curve that comes down and connects to the ground. All right, dude, we did it. We finished drawing our seals and they look awesome, except we still need to do one last thing. What is it? Color them. Yeah, color them. Now we're gonna use these three colors. We're gonna use gray, blue, and black. And this part, we are gonna fast forward, but at the end, you guys can pause it to match the same color. And we're also gonna explain what we did at the very end. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. All right. All right, Jack, good job, man. You did awesome on coloring your seal. Okay, now you guys at home can pause the video to match the same coloring. Now we used the blue and we started really dark around the seal and then we gradually got lighter and lighter towards the outside of the paper. And then we used our gray to add shading to the bottom of our seal and we used black to add shading around his nose and also around his little flippers. We hope you had a lot of fun following along with us and drawing your heart seal. Yes, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun. Now remember, it's okay if your drawings don't look exactly like ours. Our drawings look different, yep. and that's okay because your drawing looks awesome. Yep. What's the most important thing? To have fun. Yeah, to have fun. And remember, if we ever went too fast, you can always- Pause the video. Pause the video. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye. If you had fun following along in this lesson, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the circle. Then you can click the bell to get notified every time we upload new videos. I've also picked out these two other lessons I thought you'd really enjoy. Don't forget to take a photo of your child's finished artwork and share it on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter because we want to see how awesome it turned out.